What it do, y'all? We got something special. Got something special for y'all. You see it? Chrysler 300C. The one everybody wants. The big boy. This big boy with the 6.4 liter motor inside of it. Let's go ahead and get a quick little review of this bad boy real quick. Well, first off, you know I like the 300C sign. I like that little 300C. I like that. That's look good. Actually, that's the, I like how big it is. Real big. I like how big it is. I like the little open grill so we can get a little air into that big motor that it's got. Real nice. Is the bottom open too? Even the bottom grill is open. I like that. We know what that is. That's for uh, cruise control. Uh, nice little cruise. I like the little gloss black on it too, though. At the bottom where the fog lights is, that's real nice too. We're going to give them some credit for that. Usually I don't like a lot of gloss black, but I like this gloss black right here. It's real nice. Definitely real nice. The 300 lights. Man, them lights is real nice, man. Like that little crystal in there, though. Real nice. Look at them lights. I mean, it's still the same 300 lights, but it look good, though. It look good. Got the uh, octane red color on it. Nice little octane red cover. I wish that since they made it a, uh, gave it a 6.4 liter motor, they should have gave it like a little vent in the front. They should have gave it like a front, little, a little vent like all the scat packs got. They should have put a vent on it. That'd have been real nice. That would have set it off. That would have gave it that aggressive look. That it's kind, it's kind of missing an aggressive look. You know, it still look good, but it's, it doesn't look like. I ain't gonna say I ain't gonna say it don't look like it's special or nothing, but it don't got that aggressive look that you know I feel like it should have, being that it's got a 6.4 motor in it. But it's cool though. I still like it though. But yeah, it definitely should have a hood scoop. If it's got all that horsepower and ain't got no open hood scoop, I don't really like that, but it still got the nice little line on it. I like that. <laughs> Now he was a uh, called his son. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I was just saying I didn't like the. I, it should have had a uh, hood scoop on it. Yeah. Yeah. If it had a hood scoop on it, it'd, it'd look more aggressive. It would. It's got all that horsepower. It needs. It yeah. needs to have something open. <laughs> yeah. Well, let's get to the uh, wheels. These are new wheels. These are new 300 wheels right here. I definitely like these wheels. It's like a. Uh, like a metallic like grayish color if you get up close it's like a gloss gray color on it i like that but i still think they should have made it black but i mean this probably was probably a to order um 300 so he probably wanted it this color which ain't nothing wrong with it because i like it they, they shiny they look good it's got four pistons on the front i wish it, it should have had six pistons you know i mean if you're gonna send it out you got to send it out right the four piston brembos look good but six pistons would have looked a lot better if you know what i'm saying with a big old uh, rotor on there too six pistons with a big uh, slotted vented rotor that would have set it uh, set it all the way off and it's got the 245 tires i hate the 245 tire i hate that man all this power and you gonna put a 245 tire on this car come on now come on now but it's got a 245 45 sidewall it's a 20 inch wheel like that i like the 20 inch wheel the marker light you're gonna definitely they should have just made that a tinted color. They should have just tinted it. But you know they ain't never gonna tint those though. I mean it's got nice little body lines, you know. Even though it ain't got a wide body, it still got some fender flares to stick out, which I always liked at about 300s. They always got the little side fender fenders that always bulge out a little bit, a little bit wider than regular. That means you probably throw a little wider tire on there, put a little 305 on there. That look real good if you put some 305s on here. But yeah, it's looking good. It's got the little uh, blinker light on the um, mirror. It's the door color saying I wish they would have made the door handles the door handles should have been black The door handles would have looked good black, but that's cool. Ain't, ain't nothing bad about it Let me pop it open just a little bit because this somebody car so I don't really want to get too in-depth on it We got the nice leather seats with it. It's got the 300 on the uh, seats. I like that 300 C on the seats That's real special. I like that got the black leather with the white stitching steering wheel. I like the steering wheel, but I think the 300 should have made it a flat bottom steering wheel i mean instead of i know it's supposed to be luxurious but come on now we could have put a flat bottom steering wheel in here come on 300 c i like the dash i like the dash the dash looks real good real nice got the uh lighting on it ambient lighting uh, 160 on the dash ain't this a this a 300 c only got 160 on the dash it should say at least 180 it's cool though it still look good we ain't gonna we ain't gonna knock it for that i like that i mean it's got the carbon fiber as you can see the carbon fiber right the uh, uh radio controls and the climate controls we got launch mode on here a couple drive modes same little eight inch uh screen with the 300 clock right there got the 300 clock right there 
I mean, we got carbon fiber. Got your little cup holders, heated, heated and cooled cup holders. I do like that, heated and cooled cup holders. Got your little uh, USB port chargers with an uh, auxiliary, your corn holder. It's nice, I mean, we, we it's nice. I mean, it's definitely nice. Hit the little button, there goes your um, 12 volt right there. Slide it on down. It's nice, man. We, I, I'm, I'm gonna give it some love, it's definitely nice. Got the, got the big boy roof on it. It's got the big, 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 big boy roof on it. Definitely got the big boy roof on it. What kind of system is here? I'm pretty sure it's hard, hard, hard and carbon. Carton, armor and carton, carbon, whatever you say. Pretty sure that's what it is in here. But yeah, it's definitely nice. Got the metal pedals. Got the metal pedals. I mean, it's, I like what I'm seeing. But I really like that 300C in there. Let's shut the door. Doors got the same little regular locks and window controls right there. White little stitching on it. Got the leather. It's nice. It says it's got a, yeah, Harman Kardon. Yep, it's got Harman Kardon sound system. That's super nice. Super duper nice. Same thing on the back. You got a 20 inch wheel with a 245 45 sidewall. 20 inches. Four piston brakes in the back. Slide on back here. Let's see what that back look like. Look at that. Are you good? <laughs> yeah. No, nah, you good. <laughs> Got the dual exhaust. I like that. Big boy pipes. It look like about three inch pipes on the back. Three inch tips. Nice. I think they should have gave it a more aggressive uh, diffuser in the back. More aggressive diffuser would have really set it off. But it still look good. Those are 300. Got the nice big boy wing. Chrysler wing right here. I like that. I like that. I see. Okay, I see what they want with the little gray color. Because everything, all the little... Um, uh, accentuating colors is gray, so I like that. It's got the 300C, the same little gray color. Definitely like that. What a backup camera! At? I know this thing got a backup camera. I know I ain't tripping. Oh, there you go, right there. Backup camera, right there. Nice. The trunk open. Let's see. Hit the button right there for the trunk. Yeah, there goes the trunk. Major space. We got major space in here. Look at all that space. Big boy space. Yeah, got the spare tire in there. Also, let's set that real quick. Yes, I like that. Look good, got your little uh, spoiler on the back. Got your nice little spoiler too. It's nice, man, it's 300C, it's definitely nice. I mean, it's definitely nice. I see why people, a lot of people wanna get this car. It's definitely nice, got the 6.4. You got to look in the back seat, man. We almost forgot to look in the back. The back seat. Let's see what we got in the back seat. Okay, we got nice full leather, big boy bow street. Three people can fit in the back of this bad boy. You got your auxiliaries. You got your heated and heated seats back here, your vents. Everything's nice, man. This thing, this is definitely a super nice car. Now we ain't gonna sit here in front like it ain't. The new, the last great 300 is definitely super nice. Got the nice little cup holders right there. This thing is nice, man. I'm gonna tell y'all. They only want 55000 for it. 55000 at Lock Monday in Elkhart, Indiana. Mm-hmm. Look at this thing. Definitely, definitely a beautiful car. Can't go wrong with a 300. Really not my style, but it's still definitely a very lovely car, man. Definitely a very lovely car. You know, you got this big boy 6.4 under the hood. We don't even need to pop the hood. You already know what's under the hood. The big one. It is the big one. But yeah, man, I figured I'd go ahead and give y'all a quick little review of this bad boy. Let's get a little quick little walk around of him one more time. Yeah. I mean, I love this color, though. This octane red color. I definitely love the octane red color. Got the big boy dual exhaust in the back. This is a 300C, 20 inch rims with the four piston. Brembo's. Beautiful interior. As you said, we got the, 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 the dial shifter. I mean, carbon fiber in this bad boy. This is definitely a beautiful car. Somebody's gonna definitely be happy. And uh, what they, they're asking 56,000 for this car. Matter of fact, let's look and see how much they want for it. I think it's fifty-six thousand. I don't want to. I don't want to be misquoted. I want you. I don't want y'all to say T like man. You told us it was this and it was that. Let's see what they. Let's see what they want for it. They want. Hold on. Let me get y'all right real quick. 
56 595 that's a nice deal man base price is 55 they only want 56 yes sir you see what it say 300 c this ain't the little boy this the big boy you see what that say right there 6.4 liter v8 hemi you see it definitely a beautiful car definitely a beautiful machine that and there go the keys for those who want to know what the keys look like just like any other dodge chrysler key fob right there bam i like that man also look at that they got the chrysler right there for the little running board things little uh foot rest nice that they, they should have put some uh 300 c floor mats on there that'd have been crazy but that probably cost a little extra money And we got lane assist on this bad boy for those who wanted to know. We got lane assist. Yes. Yes. So let's get one last little walk around, you know. <laughs> Let me get myself in this too, you know what I mean? Yeah, look, 300 c Chrysler 300 c The big one. Beautiful car. Yes, sir. Look at that. Well, with that being said, man, hopefully y'all like this video, this car review of the 300C. I appreciate y'all for joining me today. If you want to purchase this vehicle, you can get it at Lock Monday in Elkhart. I will leave a link in the description as well as the salesman or saleswoman that you can purchase this vehicle for. 56000 no markup. There is no markup on this. So, hey, you better get it while you can get it. That being said, it's your boy. T -light. Oh yeah, big shout out to the world we we'll oh. Stay up, man, and I'm up out of here. Appreciate y'all for joining me today. I'm gone. I gotta talk quiet because we inside, you know what I'm Bye. Be the fam, that's what they call me. I promise that you never be lonely. Be the fam.